Good morning everyone, it's uh, Lance here once again and I'm going to do something a little bit radical today. I'm going to go out for a bike ride. Now why is that radical? Well I'm going to go to take my mountain bike out on the road. Um, why would I do such a crazy thing? Well we're still in the COVID-19 uh, pandemic shutdown. Um, we're allowed to go out for uh, small uh, rides to get exercise uh, near our house. It's too far to go to a mountain bike park and supposedly too dangerous to ride there as well. So I'm just going to go for a quick ride around my house. However, it's important to be safe. Mountain bikers all know about safety equipment. So what safety equipment do you need to go riding in these times? Well, obviously you need a helmet. You're going on the road, you're always riding. We always ride with our helmet. Mask, what do you reckon? Probably not a bad idea. So let's put the old mask on. All right, now we're safe. Helmet, don't know if you can still hear me. All right, so put the helmet on now. Goggles, because you know, masks don't protect you completely. All right, so we got the goggles. And just to finish, I'm always keen to ride with gloves. So just gone for some slightly heavier duty gloves. And there we go. So we're ready to go for a road ride around my street. Now I know you think this is a little bit over the top and I must admit I'm going to feel a little bit stupid riding around like this. So I've come up with another solution. I'll show you what I've got in mind. I'll just take this kit off. Whew, that feels better. All right, I'll show you what I have in mind. All right. Okay, so here we are. I've come up with a little invention to uh, keep the social distance. You don't need to wear all the mask and goggles as long as you stay two meters apart from other people that you meet um, out on the streets. So I've come up with the social distancer 2000 bar ends. Um, just attach them onto the bars, you ride along and you've got two meters either side so that you know uh, whether you're safe. Now I know what you're thinking Lance, that's pretty wide, what happens if a car's coming, they're going to clip your bar ends, and you're right, so you need to be, I've designed it, so they rotate in. So literally you can ride along with your bar ends in very very safely, and then suddenly you notice there's a lady with five dogs walking on the side of the street, what are you going to do? Flip out your bar ends, you've got your two meters, she's not going to come within two meters of you, you go past her, flip them back in, and down the street you go. So it's a brilliant idea. I am going to, it's still a prototype at this stage, but I'm hoping to get a patent out. And if you look at the link at the bottom of the, this video, there will be somewhere where you can actually buy these. So um, don't forget, uh, social distancer, 2,000 bar ends. All right, now I know what you're thinking. Yeah, but what about the front and the back, Lance? Um, how do you know two meters from front and back? Um, well, hold on in a minute, I'll just show you. Okay, so I've come up with my uh, second invention. This is the Social Distancer 2000 Head Mount. Uh, simply attached onto your helmet, and there you are. You've got two meters front and back. Simple as that. You can ride down with absolute confidence that you're maintaining that two meter gap on all, all sides. All right, must be time to go and try this thing out. All right, just heading down the driveway, um, heading out to the road with the Social Distancer 2000. Um, seems to be going pretty well so far. Uh, the tricky part was actually the head mount. Um, initially I just put a pole out the front, but of course, as you can imagine, my head wasn't very well balanced. So I've got two meters front and back, and of course my head is nice and balanced now, and it's actually going pretty well. As you can see, I've got a pretty steep driveway. I've got the scope to put in some downhill tracks either side of the driveway. Um, if we stay in lockdown, I'm probably going to look at doing that. Alright, uh, heading out to the road now, and I guess it's time to see um, what the neighbours think of my latest invention. Alright, so we're out on the road. Uh, seems to be working okay so far. Um, we just have to come and see if we can find um, someone to social distance from. Alright, so here's a cyclist just pulled out in front of me. Bring out the social distance of 2000. Oh, okay, that wasn't a perfect thing. All right, bring the bars back in, and we're away. All right. 
Okay, so here's a scenario that you might come across. Uh, you're riding along and you find a young lady, or in this case, an old lady, uh, who um, has broken down on the side of the road. Now, she should have been prepared. If you're gonna go out for a ride, you should be able to get home on your own. Um, but this lady doesn't look like she's going to. So, if I'm gonna give her some advice, I need to stay two meters apart. Always carry your tape measure. Oh, it's a bit wobbly. That's why I've got the social distancer. It works better. Oh, not easy. Super not easy. Alright, so this is two metres. So this would be an acceptable distance uh, for me to uh, help this lady out, give her some advice, because she's going to have to change her own tyre. Uh, this would be too close. And that would be way too close. So you wouldn't get that close, okay? Um, but anyway, you've either got two options. You give her a bit of advice on how to fix her bike, or the other option is you just say, uh, good luck with that, honey, and off you go. Well, I hope you enjoyed that uh, wee little video. Um, don't forget, uh, these are just prototypes, but should be available uh, to buy online uh, soon. Just check on the link at the bottom of this video. Uh, the social distance are 2,000 uh, bar ends, and also the helmet mount as well. So, um, again, not trying to make light of the situation we're all in, but you've got to have a bit of a laugh. Uh, if you like the video, click around here somewhere to subscribe, and we'll look forward to seeing you on the next one.